this video, we're going to take you through configuring your D-Link EWAN modem. The first thing you're going to need is one of these. Connect your modem to the optical network terminal or network termination device or fiber box via the WAN port of your modem using an Ethernet cable. Make sure it's plugged into the wall and the power is on. You should see a solid green light for the power icon. The port might also be labeled as LAN slash WAN, WAN slash LAN 4, or Internet. Underneath the modem is the SSID and Wi-Fi password. Use this to locate the Wi-Fi name on your computer and then join the network. Now, don't worry. When you successfully join the network, it will say no internet secured. This is because we haven't configured or set it up yet. Open the internet browser on your computer or phone and type in 192.168.1.1. You can also check the bottom of the modem for the correct IP address if that doesn't work. You'll be prompted for a username and password. Ready for it? Username in lowercase is admin. Password in lowercase is admin. You can also check the bottom of the modem. In fact, when in doubt, that's the best place to look. Once logged in, it will take you to a quick setup window. Click next to start setup. Once you're in the ISP settings window, set the WAN access type to ethernet. Then press next. Under the configure your internet connection window, select dynamic IP address. Sometimes this option may be displayed in the following format. In this case, select DHCP connection dynamic IP. Now click Next until you move to the last page in order to save the settings. Your modem should go online within two to four minutes. Please test the service once done.